Well, back in March, we first told you about turtles getting ready to cross US 40 near the Wabashiki wetland. Now that we've had the warm stretch of weather, they're on the move. News 10's Hunter Petroviak takes us searching for snappers. Amber Slaughterbeck and a team of volunteers walk up and down US 40 almost daily with a mission of saving turtles. It's not uncommon for them to spend more than two hours out here searching. She says it's a labor of love. It is a lot of time. We all care about them though, so we're willing to do it. The turtles are trying to cross from one side of the wetlands to the other across the highway. Slaughterbeck says they still don't know why they attempt to cross. We have pondered the question of what they're doing for six years now. We assume that they're just trying to get to water because as the water's drying up, you see more and more turtles trying to cross the highway. Slaughterbeck says they've already collected about 50 turtles this season. Today's search only provided one, but she says over a six year span, that number adds up. We've saved over 2,300 turtles. So think about that. I doubt very many of them would have made it across or made it to their destination. So we have made a huge impact in these turtles' lives and in the whole ecosystem's life. Slaughterbeck takes statistics of each turtle and keeps the information for research. She hopes people pay attention in the area so the animals can live and that research can continue. I just hope that they're, they're reading the signs and maybe swerving to miss them. And they'll continue their almost daily search, even if it's to save one turtle at a time. In Vigo County with photojournalist Tony Cassasia, Hunter Petroviak, News 10. If you would like to become a volunteer and help in the turtle search, go to this story on our website and find a link to the group's Facebook page.